Yo yo, it's Gmo, and today we have something a little bit different. Today we have a Moncler Maya. It came in this plastic bag right here. And as always, all content on this channel is for educational purposes only. And a massive thank you to Lukik for sending this over. So opening it up right here, we can see that the down jacket is pretty shiny. But out of the bag, it's not going to be that puffy. So you have to puff it up yourself. I didn't use the tennis ball method or pump air into it. I kind of just shook it around and it kind of inflated on its own. Now getting into the details of the Moncler Maya itself. And with this particular Maya, there is a lot of attention to detail. Even on the zippers, there is that Moncler engraving on both the front and the back on both zippers as we can see here and then there's like this plastic covering that helps protect them so you don't scratch them or whatever and then here's what the down jacket looks like after i let it puff up a bit you can really see how glossy it is through the lighting and the materials are super smooth and very high quality and then looking at all of the buttons we can see it says moncler on each button there's nothing missing and these also didn't leave fingerprints either next up we have these smaller zippers with the moncler logo embossed and then on the adjusters they have the moncler logo debossed moncler engraving near the hood and the zipper don't feel cheap either. Inside of the right pocket, it does come with these tags, and they're basically just guarantees that the product is authentic. These don't look cheap either, they're even glossy as you can see, and yeah. So as we unzip the down jacket right here and we take a look inside, we can see the inside Moncler tag as well as the other tags that come with the jacket, and it even comes with the comic strip as you can see right here. And then moving up the jacket, we have this inside zipper, along with another Moncler branded zipper, as well as the tag used for authentication. And then going back to the tag, we can see that it is square, there is even stitching, and it doesn't come off easily. And then here's the size tag right here. And then we have the staple of the Moncler products, their signature patch. Now this patch does have a bit of cross stitching, but that's normal. But overall, looking from afar and even up close, it looks really, really good. There isn't that much fraying and the stitching is very clean. So now I'm going to be modeling it to show you guys how it looks on body. Here are my stats on the screen right now if you want to know. So yeah, overall the quality of the jacket is actually spectacular and even in February it was freezing and this kept me super warm. The quality is just crazy for the price and I'll definitely be wearing this a lot more as my go-to jacket when it gets cold outside. So yeah, that was the Moncler Maya down jacket. Thanks again to Lou Kick for sending this out. If you guys want to see more clothing on the channel, whether it be from Luke Kick or just in general, please let me know what you want to see down in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.